Hello everyone. So today I wanted to go over one of the most important features of the Snap-on TPMS4, and that is doing the relearn functions in conjunction with your Snap-on scan tool, which we have right here, the Solus Ultra. So on your TPMS4, you're gonna to wanna to scroll over to the relearn function and then select the vehicle you're working on, which I have a 2016 Chevrolet Trax. So we'll go ahead and select that. Then so we can also do the manual relearn with the TPMS4, but we'll go over that in another video. So today we're gonna to do relearn TPMS4 and scanner. So when we select that option, you're gonna get some instructions that say this process requires the use of your snap-on scan tool under the tire pressure monitoring system. So in order to do that on our Solus Ultra, let's scroll over to scanner right here. Select that. And then we're going to select our vehicle, which is the Chevrolet Trax 2016. We'll go to manual ID. We'll select our Trax. Right here. 1.4 liters. It'll ask you if this is the current vehicle information. We'll go ahead and select OK. You can just tap there. And then we want to scroll all the way to the bottom, which we can click here. Under Tire Pressure Monitor, you'll want to go ahead and select that. Then we'll go over to Functional Tests. And TPM Learn Mode. So what we're going to do here is it's going to give you some instructions saying the ignition key must be on. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay. Now... We're gonna to wanna to make sure that our Solus is connected via OBD to the OBD module, which we have here, we have a green light. Now, we're gonna to wanna to select continue. Now right here at the top where it says TPM learn mode, we're gonna to wanna to select that. And then once we select that, the vehicle is now in learn mode. So now, we're gonna go back to our TPMS4, select next, four wheels. And so now from here, we're gonna to wanna to go across the car and scan each sensor individually. Now the horn is gonna chirp every time we do this. So we'll start with the left front. We'll go around here to the right front. Right rear. Oops, sorry. And now when we scan the left rear sensor, the horn should chirp twice, indicating that we've done a successful relearn. And there it is. Thanks for watching, guys.